Media madness. Well, we're doing this pretty much every day now uh, because the media is so corrupt, so out of control. Now, um, as you know, and we're going to play you some clips in the final thought, I did the John Stewart Daily Show last night. So, of course, that created hysteria in the uh, left wing media because they don't want any, anybody to do anything with me or anybody else who may have ever said a kind word about Donald Trump. That's the black ball that's in place. Now, NBC News did a fair review of my appearance with uh, Stewart. Here's what they said, quote, decade after the two hosts last sparred on air, The Daily Show, Stewart and a former Fox News host, Bill O'Reilly, reunited Tuesday, continued the debate, though compared to the extremes of today, they were more friends than foe. Stewart and O'Reilly have a history of on-air conflict, mirroring two opposite viewpoints, and O'Reilly, the conservative, foiled to Stewart and vice versa. Stewart and O'Reilly showed much of the same friendly back and forth Tuesday as they did in 2014. Phil Hessel wrote that. And it's true. And it was a longer article, but I'm just telling you the tone of it wasn't O'Reilly's the devil. And why is Stewart doing this? Which was the tone in the far left hate brigades, gutter snipe alley where they live. Washington Post is the worst because they're a serious, so-called serious newspaper. The Internet sites, you know them, are just ugh, awful. But um, I noted the Washington Post, Bezos, and I noted it. Thank you for watching. To view full episodes of the No Spin News anytime, sign up to become a BillOReilly.com premium or concierge member today.